Welcome to Silent Motorist Media, the YouTube channel. Yeah, we're, we're putting together a YouTube channel. Why not? Well, I can tell you one reason why not. My camera quality is terrible, actually. Um, I'm just kind of looking at this thing and kind of aghast at that uh, computer cameras are still functioning on this level in 2020 but yeah um you know maybe if uh this maybe if we decide to keep up doing a youtube segment then we'll get a better camera and audio equipment why not um until now uh, at the, at this moment though it's just uh totally an experiment there is nothing final or certain about this um this is just a one off thing i decided to try but for today, we will go ahead and get into our uh, review, which is going to be a VR Jaeger's Negative Space. Negative Space came out this year from Apocalypse Party. Uh, Jaeger had released in the past from uh, Schism Press, I believe, which uh, is over there where uh, Gary J. Shipley is and all those great fellas. Um, but yeah, this, uh, Negative Space is, uh, from Apocalypse Party, and it is a, like a cyber coming-of-age occult novel, and it's just blew me out of the water. I, uh, I was totally impressed by this thing. And the reason being is because it felt so authentic compared to a lot of coming-of-age novels. Uh, you follow a group of like four disillusioned late high schoolers going into graduation through their just grad their senior year landscape basically. Follow these characters who are who are connected in some way. Either they're dating or they know each other. They all get to know each other by the end of the book, and you follow them through this just kind of this dark descent. That is just accentuated by drug abuse and suicide. Suicide looms heavily in this book. It's really a bleak and depressing read. But it's terrifying, too, in that you always get a sense that something is lurking behind the scenes that's motivating uh, the progression of these characters. Something that you can't see, and it really adds a nice depth to the... Uh, typical coming of age and the coming of age novels to me just tend to be really one note you have a uh, angry kids um doing angry things and uh it leads to some disaster and it's just it's like the narrative stoops to its subject matter uh it tries to inhabit the brain of a teenager and all it can think of is the one strong emotion that that uh, author was feeling when they were a kid and it, they just go with it 100%. And it's just kind of a flat read to me. There's so many books like that. So many coming-of-age novels I've tried to read that I just I just can't do. There's really good ones out there, too. But as, as a genre and as a, as a theme in general, I, I, it just doesn't tend to be for me. I really like the nuance of negative space. I like the darkness of negative space and it's and it's genuinely scary. I mean there's also there's supernatural elements, there's occult elements that feel really fresh, feel really 21st century, that feel really new and that's that's huge for me. Is if it feels new then that's great. That's that's what I'm always looking for. I'm always looking for the new thing in horror. And uh B.R. Yeager's Negative Space is certainly a contender. I uh, recommend checking it out. I'm going to put the link down there in the description. And uh, yeah, I think I'm, that wraps up this short review, the short video review, this video visual experiment with Auto Silent Motors Media. The link to the website's down there as well. Um, we've got a lot of great projects coming up, uh, soon to be announced. And I'll be posting those on the website. I can't quite talk about them yet. But several great books coming out of Silent Motorist Media that uh, I hope you'll hear about soon. Um, yeah, maybe we'll see you next time. Maybe we'll do this again. For sure, check out B.R. Jaeger's Negative Space. And until next time, adios.